Yo, what's going on guys? This is Frosty and first I would like to give some massive shout outs to TC19 for reaching out to me on TikTok and featuring me on the channel of course it's much appreciated so we decided to do an interview about me of course so let's begin so the first question we have here you briefly introduce yourself of course this is Frosty or uh, I'm Abdallah uh, if you want to call me by my real name so I'm 26 years old um, like I love pump it up so much and like any games in general like I'm a gamer myself I love to play games like all of the time um, okay uh, when did you start playing pump it up and there's a brief history about your pump it up years okay so pump it up it's actually like it I didn't expect to find such a game in Egypt because unfortunately um, like games like uh, Dance Dance Revolution is non-existent here whatsoever I'm not sure why so my story is that I actually visited uh, Mall of Egypt like by chance um, like it happened that I just be there and I went to the arcade hey let's give it a look let's check out the arcade and stuff and I immediately fell in love with Pump It Up I know it's not the same as DD the DDR or the SS Revolution but it's the same concept basically and I really like Pump It Up songs like um, since I have started playing I've never stopped since then so I started like uh, it was on 8th of August 2019 and I marked that day because like I fell in love with the game and I knew that I want to become like one of the best players in the game like it's the passion like <laughs> I can't stop playing like I want to reach high levels and currently play like on let's say from 11 to 12 I'd say like it depends on the songs but of course I want to reach 20-ish levels in the future so okay the next question we have how often do you go to the arcade and how many days do I train so I go to the arcade like depends on my schedule like I try to go once a week or maybe once every two weeks depends like, if I'm a bit busy or so um, but I really like to not take a long of a break just so I do not uh, like lose uh, momentum and stuff because you feel like you need to warm up more and you're like rusty if you have not played in ages okay so how many arcades do you know in Egypt that has pump it up so I know three arcades so basically you have Mall of Egypt which is the one I play at and uh, there is another arcade that's called Dendi Mall and another one that's called Porto Cairo Egypt and Dendi Mall and Porto Cairo are basically owned by the same company but honestly like Mall of Egypt is the best place to play at because it's a bit active especially like on the weekends but I've went multiple times to like either Porto Cairo or Dendi Mall and it's just basically dead there nobody's even touching the cabinet so yeah it's uh, like a little dead um, I definitely advise if you're in Egypt to play at Mall of Egypt it's more easy to meet new people to meet other players yeah so next question we have here 
what is my long term and short term goals? So my short term is consistently nailing down the doubles. Like I can do some doubles, but I'd say maybe at level seven to level eight. I cannot do like nine and beyond like as of now it's tricky like because most of the time I'm playing singles and singles your brain is just used to the five buttons but with doubles you have to like uh, get used to playing in two, uh, two pads like basically you're playing on the pads for yourself on the whole pads the left and right one and it can be tricky. My long-term goals are definitely like reaching 24. <laughs> it's gonna take ages, I know. Like it's not easy whatsoever. I mean, reaching 15 would be an accomplishment for me. But hey, I definitely wanna reach 24 someday and play like the crazy songs. <laughs> I see some crazy levels on YouTube and I definitely wish that my level would increase and play these crazy levels as well <laughs> okay the next question we have it's what's my favorite pump it up song so i love hip-hop and it's gotta be the one one tym hot this is definitely one of my favorites i cannot stop playing the song so a friend showed me this song and since then i always play it like even during my practice sessions, I have to play it at least once or so. <laughs> so the next question we have here, what's your best achievement you've ever done at Pump Up? My best achievement would be clearing Heartbreaker on S15, but it was quite tricky for me to clear that song, but I kept practicing and I eventually got it. Now, what's your hardest song in Pump It Up that you're still working to improve? So the hardest songs I could think of two songs. The first one would be Hardcore of the North in the RS11 and the other one would be Dignity in S12. Like these ones are super hard. Like the song itself is not hard but it's hard because it needs a lot of stamina. And the last like the last totally last part is quite tricky for me I still need to practice that to nail down but hey I'm sure that I definitely I'll uh, be able to clear it okay the next question do you have an Egyptian pump it up community to hang out with and let tell us briefly so I would say yes I definitely met some friends uh, from the arcades from playing Pump It Up. Like we support each other and exchange tips on how to improve and stuff. So uh, definitely, like I'd say, we do not like meet that often. It depends on um, if you were able to schedule it with everybody because sometimes like someone is uh, like uh, busy for some reason or is unavailable. But definitely we do like when we have the chance. Okay, so the next question, do you want to encourage more new Egyptian players and pump it up so they would establish like a strong pump it up community and in the future they could create like, uh, we would create like tournaments and so definitely of course, I definitely like to encourage new people to start pump it up because it's so much fun to play this game. And it's actually some sort of workout as well because you're moving your whole body, like you're burning energy. So definitely yes, some people like come to me and ask me um, like how am I playing that well or like how do they get in the into the game and I definitely like give them some tips and so um, I definitely want to like encourage um, like new players, I want the game to be more famous and this is actually why I started posting videos on TikTok like I wanna create a community in Egypt for this game and definitely for pump for Dance Dance Revolution once we have it uh, of course in Egypt okay would you like to compete in a tournament one day 
Definitely, yes. I would love to compete in a tournament, I love competition. Uh, it's like always motivating if you're playing with somebody else you're competing. It always pushes you further to improve. And at last we have anything would you like to add? So I would say definitely keep practicing, especially if you're a new player. Keep practicing because the game might seem hard at first, like especially when you're like moving on to the harder levels. For example, if you're playing on four, you wanna go to like maybe six, five or six. At first, it can seem like very hard and stuff. But you just need to learn the pattern you have to be pressing the buttons at. And as they say, practice makes perfect. And I would like to thank you for watching this video and I would like to thank TC19 once again for featuring me. I hope uh, everybody has enjoyed and I hope that I will motivate you of course to improve and pump it up. Thank you so much.